Yes, after you've unboxed your V3 antenna, this is a model uh, 15, you'll be faced with a myriad of, of cables and how to connect this to your router. Now you'll find that there's two LTE connectors, they actually marked 2G, 3G, 4G, that, that's the, the, the two connectors on this side. You have two connectors that are labeled 2.4 and 5 gig, that is your Wi-Fi antennas. And then on the side here you've got one that is marked as GPS GLONASS. So we're using the, the RET, Teltonica RET 955 as an example. Now you'll see, I'll just put this down like such, you'll see that we have mobile and mobile uh, connectors marked here. They marked as mobile main and mobile auxiliary. This is where your two cables marked 2G, 3G, 4G is going to, to go. So whilst we're at the top, the one that's marked uh, GPS GLONASS, that'll connect to the one that's marked GPS. It's also GNSS, it doesn't, doesn't matter. The antenna is made for your, GP, for your GPS signal. Then if we move down here, the two remaining cables, the two Wi-Fi, you'll find that the, these two cables, 2.4 and 5 gig, they go onto the two uh, connectors made, uh, marked as Wi-Fi. You'll also see that uh, at pointing, we've uh, installed these little uh, grip extenders Typically when you, when you screen down your SMA connector, you would have found that it is very difficult to tighten these just using your fingers. When you slide the grip extender over it and you then tighten it, you'll find that it's a lot easier to tighten it nicely onto the, on the connector over here. 